5G phones are expensive, phones with curved screens are expensive. Neither one of these is expensive. In fact, they will both cost under $500 when they launch in 2020. I'm at CES and we're going to take a look at the TCL 10 5G and the TCL 10 Pro. Let's start with the TCL 10 5G. Now, this phone is a big deal because it is going to be under $500 and 5G phones so far are really pricey. We still haven't gotten to that place where there are mid-range 5G phones. That might be okay because we also haven't gotten to a place where there are plentiful 5G networks all over the world. So the two are really going to be maturing hand in hand. So the stronger the 5G networks are, the more pervasive they are, uh, the more opportunity there is to bring people on board. So the more demand there will be for cheaper 5G phones. This phone will definitely fit that demand. Now you're forgiven if you don't recognize TCL as a brand, for phones especially. Uh, TCL is known best for making good quality and affordable TVs and they want to approach the phone industry in the same way. So you're gonna see a lot of affordable devices from them. We know a few things about this device, but TCL hasn't given us a ton of the specs. They're gonna hold off for MWC, Mobile World Congress, to really dive into those. But we do know that there is a large screen here with a front-facing camera that is a punch hole design over here on the left. It does have a headphone jack, so if you love your wired headphones, you'll be happy. There's also a USB-C charger port. And on the back, we've got a generosity of cameras. There are four of them and two flashes. The back of the phone says that it is a 64 megapixel main camera. So you can expect that as well as a macro lens and an ultra wide fingerprint reader on the back as well. Now, I noticed immediately that this is sort of a fingerprint magnet and it feels like it's a plastic backing. It could be glass, but for only about $500, I think that is a trade-off that is well worth it. When I hold the phone in the light in a certain way, there's this kind of cool iridescent diamond cut pattern. It's completely flat. It's just sort of something that you see, this trick of the light. I think that's pretty nice. Compared to a lot of the edge-to-edge -edge displays that we're seeing, the bezel here feels a little bit thick, but it does give you a handhold and a grip, and you'll be less likely to touch the phone with your palm as you're holding and using the device. So that's the affordable 5G device, but the one I'm really excited about is the TCL 10 Pro. I mean, immediately seeing them side by side, it's like night and day. You've got this sort of plasticky looking thing and then you've got this really polished phone. And remember, this phone is also going to cost you only about $500. It will be 4G instead of 5G, but looking at it, the screen just totally pops. And in fact, it kind of looks like a Galaxy S11 clone. From the front, that's kind of what it is. You've got these dual, curved screens here, it's AMOLED display, all this rich color. There's even a pull-out menu on the side that acts as sort of like a shortcut tab to your favorite apps. You've got a U-notch selfie cam here on the front. Again, you've got this headphone jack and USB-C charging. The headphone jack is a really nice touch. And this color on the back is really beautiful. This is glass and it's sort of got this like satiny finish and again, this trick of the light where you get this deeper, richer color. I don't see my fingerprints and it feels just really good to hold, really polished. Uh, you would not look at this and think this only costs $500. The camera story is pretty good too. You've got a 64 megapixel main camera. There are four sensors back here as well, two flashes. You're definitely gonna get ultra wide and you're gonna get macro. We don't have a lot of information about the specs yet. Again, we'll get those in late February, but we do know that the phone will run Android. And we also know that it is coming to North America. So expect it in the US and Canada as well as globally. So this is your first look at the TCL 10 5G and TCL Pro. Make sure that you check with CNET and subscribe for all of the CES coverage here from the show.